Hi guys, it's Debbie and I'm going to work on a fluid painting today. Um, I'm going to do it on a record. Whoops, a record. <laughs> um, okay, I just want to tell you, I have filled in the hole um, and I put a little modeling paste on there, acrylic modeling paste. You can use the acrylic modeling paste, you can buy it to put texture on your paintings. I do that quite a bit. I mean, I have several paintings that I put that on. It's it's a nice hard hard surface for you to paint on. Anyways, um, so I have that on there, and then I took black uh, Lake Desk paint, and I've covered the the record. So on that side, this side I just I'm gonna leave it. It's not that important. Um, <laughs> I'm in the art room. I already got paint on that side. So, anyways, I'm going to um, pull you down. I have some colors mixed up, and we're going to pour our cool painting on here, we hope. <laughs> All right, guys. Okay, guys. Um, we're all ready. Um, the red is a little thicker than all the rest, which sometimes I've felt that I get good effects when it's a little... I don't know if you can tell on video how that kind of takes its time coming off compared to yellow. I don't know. It's hard. Maybe without you feeling it, you can't do it. But anyways, um, the rest of them were all mixed the same. I got a couple different colors here, and I'm just going to put them all into the cup and see what happens. So um, let's start with yellow. How about that? Yellow. Nope. Well, and I stirred that pretty good, I thought. <laughs> let's see. Let's see if that one goes across the top. I just have some leftover pink from my last pour I did. So I'm just going to shove those couple little drops in there. And then we put a little bit of all the colors. Oh, we didn't have any. Let's put a little teal in. This one feels kind of runny, so. That's quite a bit. <laughs> That's quite a bit. And I know my white was a little runny. So the thing is, when they're a little thicker, they don't um, they don't blend together so easy. So that you know the colors will be sharp sitting next to each other. So all of these paints um, have a little bit of silicone in them. All it takes is a little tiny bit. Oops, we want to do this side. Huh. Almost did the wrong side, guys. Oh well, which would have been fine. <laughs> I'd have just had to finish this side later on. Kind of like letting it loose a little like that. <laughs> Alright, my table's a little crooked. Before I move it too much, I want to give it I'm gonna give it a quick hit with the torch. Which will bring up the air bubbles down underneath. I like, I like little streamers in there. I'm going to try before I move it a whole lot. Where's some, do white? Maybe we'll do some white. Um, I know what. I'm just going to take the fork. I want them thin. Okay, I'm going to get dots. Well, maybe these dots are going to be really cool. <laughs> so I'll go ahead and make some more dots. You do, I mean, any of you guys that have done this before realize that you don't have a whole lot of control with this. You don't really know what it's going to end up like. Let's try that with this one. Mm. 
Let me try the other side, see if it's, maybe I just need to, yeah, that's better. I'm trying to watch it move a little bit. Um, I don't think there's much more of that. I don't know, it just sounded like a good idea at the time to do this. I'm always wanting to play with this, do something a little different. So, I mean, we'll move it now. Remember to not pour off something you like. I've done that a whole bunch of times. You guys have watched me. I'm sure your mouth was open going, oh my God, she just poured off the best part. <laughs> I know, it's so hard. And you guys will do better because if you're not making a video and trying to move your mouth at the same time, it makes it a little harder. Well, I have to admit, I don't like it. <laughs> so I've got to come up with something here that I like. I like it a little better with the little cells right in there, so that I'm kind of happy with. So. You know what I could do? Let's see what see what happens if we hit it with the torch again. It might do something. And it might not. I did a little bit. We had a little bit of stuff come up. Guys, you just keep moving until you go, stop. I like that right there.
Don't ask me why I'm doing that, because I have no idea. It just seemed like a good idea at the time. <laughs> That's how it rolls, right? Trying to keep it a little creative. You can keep moving this and adding paint till, what was that saying, as the cows come home? Till the cows come home? <laughs> till you say it's done. I think it's done guys um I think the only other thing I could possibly do to this is um start over or something and I think I'm gonna leave it alone because I'm um I'm gonna let it dry and see what happens if it stays the same I, I might keep it so anyways you guys there's some uh, hold it up if you can't see some of the stuff going on oops Sorry about that. Whoa! <laughs> you guys. <laughs> oh, God. Anyways. <laughs> Story of my life. Anyways. <laughs> Might have had to change it, right? I'm going to leave it alone. Kind of like, um, I kind of like leaving it sort of like maybe that on the bottom. I'm not sure. Right on the bottom or on the top. Anyways. Okay, guys, I appreciate you for stopping by. And if you have any questions, please put them before. Bleh, put them below. <laughs> and I will try to answer them. <laughs> um, thank you. Bye-bye.